Black Myth Wukong contains five Skandhas. Finding the first four Skandhas is needed to spawn the secret superboss, Giant Shigandang, in Chapter 6. He then drops the fifth Skanda, and once you have all five Skandhas, you can bring them to Shu Dog in Zodiac Village. He will craft you the five Skandhas pill, which will increase all your attributes. In this video, I'll show you everything step by step. In the first chapter, you'll find the Skanda of Form at Front Hills, just before the Bullguard boss. When you gather all six Buddha's eyeballs and head to the massive boulder in the Stone Vanguard Arena, you'll discover that you can interact with it to place the eyeballs inside. Once you do this, the boulder will rise and transform into the secret Yao Guai King, Shigandang. Prepare for a battle reminiscent of the Stone Vanguard, but with a tougher opponent. He's large and lumbering, delivering powerful blows. The real threat comes from the shockwaves generated when he slams or pulls his fists from the ground. Once defeated, he drops the Skanda of Feeling. In Chapter 3, you can find the Skanda of Thought in Valley of Ecstasy, close to the Mindfulness Cliff Shrine. In Chapter 4, you can find the Skanda of Choice in Webbed Hollow after reaching the Purifying Spring Shrine.
The last skandha, the skandha of consciousness, is dropped by the giant Shigandang boss in Chapter 6, at Verdant Path. Once you have all five skandhas, you just need to speak with Sue Dog to get the five skandhas pill. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content on Black Myth Wukong and other exciting games. How astounding it is, the five skandhas are but abstract notions, yet you have made them tangible. Might I be permitted to make something with them? Uncover the secrets of sky and earth, and thou shalt have pills. <laughs> All things can be my material, yet I choose the rarest few. <laughs>